I'm ready for the open. How about you? Tuesday. So the full Tuesday generally for myself is the busiest day of the week. It's full round day. Throughout that round of golf, we've discussed where the wind direction is and how certain holes are gonna play. We know the tough holes, we know the easy holes. I think what you need to do first and foremost is assess the book, assess the course, get the right line off the tee where you're happy to hit it. So you've got a comfortable picture when you stand on the tee in all different wind situations. Relationships with caddies, very important uh, every day, not just practice days. Terry has been with me for six and a half years and uh, we get on great, we've got the same sense of humour. You know, you need to rely on your caddy at certain times to be able to give you the right information. I mean, he really is the jockey um, that kind of needs to bring that horse home. I don't really have any superstitions, um, but, you know, I don't use number three golf balls. I, I won't ever mark a ball tails up. It would always be heads up. I can't carry more than three tea pegs in my pocket and I will always start with three tea, tea pegs in my pocket. I can't use a yellow tea peg, I can only use a white tea peg. Bags always got to be neat. The clubs always have to be in the right slots. Uh, yeah, but I don't have any superstitions. <laughs> I definitely feel my game has strengthened over the years. I've, I've seen a lot more shots than I have, I have now than I have a few years ago. So I think I've got a, a good level of understanding of how my brain works, how my golf game works in certain situations. The years are rolling, I'm 37, I'm not getting any younger, so I've got to work harder to win one of these big tournaments. But I feel that every day I play, I learn something new and I'm always trying new little things to try and improve the golf game. <laughs>